Hi everyone, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me for another video. So today I'm going to be decorating the pages in my classic happy planner for the week of December 27th to January 2nd. I think in my last video I mentioned that like my last spread was my last spread in this planner, but it's not because I forgot I'm using an 18 month planner. So this is the only planner that I'm not changing for 2022. All my other planners I believe I'm changing. I'm pretty sure I am. Like they all have a start date in uh, January. So I still have this week in December to decorate. So I'm going to continue on because January is just going to go into the third. It's going to start on, on the third in my 18 month planner. So yeah, I'm going to decorate these pages. I want to do a Christmas Disney spread. And I kind of got an idea to do something since... Again, it's, it's, I thought last week was my last spread. I did like a scene, but this week I want to do another scene, like a Disney scene. I'm actually really excited about this one. Hopefully it works out, but I have it in my head, like the, and I, and a concept and yeah, I'm hoping it'll transition onto paper the way I'm thinking of it in my head. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to do a little scene since I'm going to Disney on Thursday. I have this whole week off from work, which I'm super excited about. Definitely very much needed. I plan on going to visit my brother, I think on Wednesday. So yeah, I, I don't really, I'm just going to be hanging out, having fun, that type of thing. Uh, and usually when I have a week like that, I don't, I don't mind taking up room doing it, doing a decorative scene spread. So yeah, that's what I plan on doing. I have this Disney sticker book. This is uh, Oasis Adventure. I have Squad Life. I just got this one in a mystery bundle that I recently picked up. Um, and I'm gonna pull in some other books. Whenever I do scenes, especially like specific ones like this, I pull a lot of sticker books. So yeah, that's the plan for this spread. Okay, so I'm starting to pull some stickers that I can possibly use. I like that these actually have like clouds in them because I plan on going, It's it's been raining on and off here, uh, which is good, but then it's not because I plan on going to Disneyland and it's gonna rain that day. Um, not all day, I don't think, but it's still gonna rain, but yeah, it is what it is. So it kind of looks like, like little clouds in the sky. So that's, I think that's cute. I was gonna do uh, a pa uh, paper on the bottom but I think I might just do I don't know if I should just do washi I kind of want to just do washi but maybe not this one you know what I'm just going to do a grid washi on the bottom just to make it easy on myself okay so here I wanted to layer another washi on top though because I like the layered look I just don't know yet what washi to layer. So, let me see. What can I do? You know what? I'm just going to do the grid washi because I don't know what else to add there. I could always add something later. So, I'm going to put this because I like this little scene. Little Disney scene. I like that Minnie's in here because, you know, there's characters at Disney. So, I feel like it goes. And if I mix in some girls here too, like these girls, I thought would be cute to add in the scene. Oops. Like that. Um, I think I have some trees or something in here. Yeah. I like palm trees, which we have palm trees everywhere here, so very fitting. I do want to put a Christmas tree though, since I am going like when it's going to be decorated for Christmas, which I'm super excited to see that because I haven't been to Disney around Christmas time in a while, so that'll be really nice. And then the last thing I want to do with these girls is I want to at least add ears onto one of the girls, I think maybe this girl. I think I'll be able to do that. So I have like little ears here that I'm just going to take and 
I'm gonna cut these little ears right here. I think this is gonna be so cute. Okay, Let's see if this works. <laughs> so I'm gonna try to cut around just the um, outline. I just want the ear part. Honestly, if I get a little bit of the the head, like the rounded part on the head, that's fine because it's kind of like the headband look like that. So there you got little ears that I'm gonna put on top of this girl, on top of her hat, like so. Actually, that kind of fits perfectly for her on there. <laughs> so at least she has some little ears. Cute. She's like a Disney. We'll say she's at Disney. <laughs> That's a little Disney scene. Okay, I love that. Okay, so that came out super cute. Uh, the other side, I'm not sure on yet. Because um, this was, I feel like this was pretty easy since I had this big scene. I feel like this mini worked like proportion wise with these girls and yeah, I don't really have anything like what, for whatever reason, I don't have anything with, um, like Mickey. I want to put Mickey on this side of the page since I don't have Mickey on, on, on the spread yet. So I pulled this Mickey cause I feel like his size is good cause that Mickey is too small, way too small, but I like this building. I like this building too, but I would have to cut many out. That's the thing. Okay, so I'll have to do like some sticker surgery a little bit with these. So let's see, let me figure this out. Or actually, maybe I could find a smaller building. Okay, I have this one. Okay, let me pull these because I did want to add a Christmas tree into the spread. Oops. I'm actually gonna, it's okay if I rip Mickey. Yeah, because I plan on like covering him up in a way. So I'm actually just gonna cut him out a little bit. So I just want the building part. So that's all I really need. I'll cover him up with this Mickey, I guess. Can I cover him up? No. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do. Yeah, these buildings. Yeah, I could put this building over here. Okay, I'm just trying to figure out, figure out the buildings because that's the part I'm not 100% sure on how I want to do this. I do like these colors though. So I could do this here. didn't notice this one. I feel like this scene might be good. It's going to take up a lot of room though. You know what? I think it'll work. Because I feel like this Mickey will be easy to cover up. So let me pull this one. Let's see. I could put this here. And then I wanted to put some girls put these girls here. I could ex extend this out a little bit so that way I normally don't go into the sidebar area but I could put the girls like over here and then a girl over here. I did want to put a Christmas tree down though. That's the only part I'm trying to figure out. Maybe I should move this and put a Christmas tree behind them. Maybe that'll be better just so I can get it on the page. I actually have the cutest Christmas tree that I just got from this a year of planning i think i mentioned this in my like favorite small shop so this is from whimsy lux this is my first time ordering from whimsy lux but this is marielle from a mom and a girl with plans a mom and a girl with plans i think that's what she is on instagram but uh she is a mentor on the happy planner squad and there's this super cute christmas tree that i think i can use since you know it's going to be decorated with all the Christmas stuff so I feel like I need it a Christmas tree because that's one of the things I'm super excited is to go and see all of the Christmas decorations that are there so let me lift this girl up I can 
you guys can. Okay. So let me put this down here. And then let me put them down. Okay, I'm happy with that. All right, so then I'm gonna put this Mickey, oh, actually, let me put Washi down first. Here. Okay, and then I was gonna put this here, so that way I could put this girl here, I could probably give her some ears since I feel like I have enough space around her to do that. Yeah. And I put these girls. Oh, you know what? I'm sorry. I, I meant to do washi all the way across. Okay, let me redo that because I want washi going all the way across since I plan on like having the it go into this space a little bit. I like have, having them uh, have somewhere to like stand on and I feel like this is kind of like the ground in a way for this spread oh my gosh I just had like an ant crawling around here which is really weird uh, but I film in the garage so that's why there's like sometimes there's ants and it's been raining a lot so you know the ants like to come out when that happens um yeah I'm gonna put these actually I need to cover this up okay I'm actually going to try to cut some of the Mickey off so that way I don't have to cover up, like, everything of the Mickey. And then I think I might go in with, like, um, like, some white pen. Actually, I might go in with just the Tombow. Let's see how that looks, actually. I think that might be the easiest. Well, let me see actually before I do that. Let me see how it looks like layered on top of here a little bit. I mean, it's not terrible. He doesn't cover them up completely though. That's the problem. Okay. Slightly too big. Why is he so big? Is he big? I don't know why he looks so big. Maybe I'll do um, another one that's like a different position. Maybe that'll cover it a little bit better. Right, maybe this one. We'll see this one. He kind of looks like the right size. I, this is the one time I wish these were paper. <laughs> because it would be so easy. I would just stick it right on top and it wouldn't be a big deal. Okay. Let's see. I mean, I could make it paper, actually, but I don't want to do all that. Okay, so I feel like this is a better Mickey. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna, you know what, I'm just gonna go with it. I'm gonna cover this up with white out. Okay, hopefully this goes okay. I don't really... Actually, I think if I did mess up, I could easily take this off. I don't know. Actually, I've never done that before, so I have no idea. But that's what I'm going with. It's not the best. Oh my gosh, it looks terrible. I know. I think I know what I'm going to do. Because I don't like the way that looks. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this sticker. I'm just going to do, like, total sticker surgery situation because it looks terrible like i said if, if if that sticker was um paper this would not be an issue but i'm just going to take this and kind of fill in these like random colors that i have going on just so that way like 
doesn't look like I have this white out. So this white out is really, really noticeable under stickers. So I have that one that I can use. I just need like a reddish color for there. So let's see what I got. Oh, perfect, I have this one. So I'm just gonna snip some off the bottom. <laughs> This is gonna work. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. <laughs> it looks terrible, but um, I'm going to cover it up. So hopefully it's not as noticeable. Yeah, it's not. Okay, cool. I think that worked because the whiteout was terrible. I'm gonna cut this white part off. My little sticker surgery for the for the video. I've never done that before, so that was good that at least I was able to pull that off. So I like that. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so this is gonna go here on top of this, like so. And then where's my Mickey? Mickey is gonna go on top of here, like so. In front right there cute cute and then I have this girl I'm gonna stick here she's just walking I'm gonna put some ears on her and then I have these girls they look like they're just shopping so I like that and I'm gonna stick some ears probably on this girl because that one has cute little like um, buns on her hair on her head so that looks cute I don't want to mess with that Okay, um, I kind of wish, I wish this was not, um, clear, but it is, so I'm gonna just let it be, because I don't have another Mickey, unless I can find another Mickey, but I'm gonna let it be, at least it doesn't look too terrible <laughs> like it did before with all the white out, I don't know, okay, I'm gonna move on and put some Mickey ears on these girls, Maybe I'll do a different color for these other girls. So let's see, I have this girl. Maybe I'll do her with green since she's got like some green leggings. I'm gonna do this green Mickey head right here. I love the colors in this Disney Oasis one. The colors are just really pretty and they actually pair well, really well with this um, Squad Life, the Squad Life, Squad, Squad Life sticker book. Oh my gosh, that's too adorable. Her little ears. I love that. And then on this one, I'm going to stick some ears on her. And I think I'm going to do... What color should I do? I kind of want to do the pink ones. I'll just do the pink ones again, like the peachy color ones. I think this one's really pretty. So cutting these out. Cute. Stick those on top of her head, like so. Okay, so they look a little empty over there. So I'm gonna take this little palm tree that I pulled earlier and I moved. I'm actually going to, oh my gosh, I'm gonna take them off the page first. And then I'm gonna put them down. But I'm gonna put this down first just so I can get it on this spread and kind of like fill them, fill in the gap right here with them. Like that. Okay, cute. So there's my little scene. I'm actually gonna do a few more things to the buildings because they don't feel as Christmassy. And you know, when you go to Disneyland during Christmas time, it is super Christmassy. So I wanna kind of replicate that feeling um, down in the bottom. So I'm happy with like the most part of this spread. I'm just not happy with how that Mickey turned out just because I can't really see his face. So I'm gonna have to fix that. I think I might do that off camera because I'm not sure how I'm gonna do it, but yeah, I'm gonna figure that out later. Um, but I wanna add these little wreaths since, like I mentioned, you know, Disney is always super decorated for Christmas. So I'm just gonna add some little wreaths 
around just to make it more Christmassy, especially on this side of the page because I don't have very many like Christmas elements on this side of the page. Um, I don't know if I have anything else in here that would go. I feel like I need to just move on to um, functional stuff <laughs> because I'm taking so long figuring this out. But it's really, really cute. I love this part of the spread. I really like this washi. I wonder if I have more of it. I don't think I do. <laughs> okay, maybe I can find some presents or something. Honestly, I feel like I have a ton of stuff like on the bottom and I think I'm probably good. I don't want to overwhelm the spread too much with things. Yeah, I'm just going to figure out the Mickey later. I'm going to move on to like functional stuff, which actually I haven't even thought of like what books I'm pulling from for this spread because it's so like many different colors and so random and um, yeah, I don't know. I have no idea what I'm doing. I only thought of this part of the spread to be honest. So yeah, fun. Okay. Let's see which book to use for functional stickers. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna keep it pretty neutral since I could play off of these like neutral colors with this sticker book, the Happy and Grateful sticker book. I think this will be really pretty to use in this spread. So I have this little checklist, which I actually don't even know if this is gonna fit. So I'll test it out right now. But I literally like it. It's it's not gonna fit. I don't know. Why doesn't it fit? That's so funny. Hmm. I don't know why it doesn't fit. But you know what I can do? You know, I don't really need the checklist, so I'm just gonna cut. Maybe I'll just leave a little bit of the beige tan line. So I have a little color. And I can add this down here. I don't know what size planner this is meant for, so obviously it's not for the classic <laughs> catch all or uh, vertical. Classic vertical. Okay, so this is gonna go here. Okay. I'm just covering it. I like that it's just simple, it has lines, which I use that side for a little to-do list, so that works perfectly there. And yeah, I'm just gonna grab some boxes. So like I said, I don't really have much going on this week besides like going to Disney and enjoying my week off from work. I like this. Think happy. That's cute. Um, I think I have a box. that I want to use for this spread. Okay, here we go. So, I need another color though, because I don't want it just to be beige. Put it on the wrong day. That's funny. I'm going to put this on Thursday. Like that. 
like I said, I'm not doing much, so it's okay if things get taken up by um, a lot of this, these stickers. I like this. This is different. Whoa, this is huge. I didn't realize it was this big. You know what? I'm just going to use it. I'm a circle sticker. I guess this is all going to be beige on top. I don't know. Maybe I can find a pop of color. Oh, you know what? I can find a pop of color. I know. This sticker book. But the functional one. Okay, so I have this book, which is this Oasis one. Wow. I'm like standing now and I can see how crooked my stickers are. Wow, these are so crooked. Let me just fix this really quick. Everything's crooked. I'm just going to try to do my best, too. <laughs> it's so bad. Oh, well. It is what it is. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's okay. Um, I can use this one because I can cover up the mini really easily with something. Could have covered her up with this sticker. I wish they wouldn't put mini on everything. Or Mickey and Minnie on everything. Okay. So I'm going to just, um, wipe this out, the mini. That does not work for me. Put this here. And I can have like a little cluster and I have a little bit of color on the page up there. Oops. Okay, I like that. That works. Let's see if I can find another sticker. Okay, so I have this one. That could work. Let me see what else I have. Don't have any checklists. I already checked. I used all the checklists that um, would have fit this theme already. There's some really cute quotes, but they have Mickey and Minnie on them. And I just don't like having that many Mickey and Minnie stickers all over my spread. So, yeah. I think that side looks cute. Let me just stick some more shit. Oh no, I kind of like that, that that corner is rounded, so I don't want to cover that up. I'm just going to do this here. Mm. Actually, I don't like that. Never mind. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to keep it simple on the top. I think that's what I need to do. I have it so busy down here. But I feel like I just need to keep it very simple over there. Okay, let me get another box. Actually, I don't think there's small boxes in here. There's these. Oh, I have checklists. Hmm. This color is bothering me. Sorry, I'm like all over the place. I don't know what I want to do. I know I don't like this color. I feel like I just need to keep it very neutral. Hopefully I have a pink box. Okay, so I have this one. How can I make this work? mini bow. <laughs> I guess that won't work. 
Okay, I'm gonna do this a little bit differently. Just so I can get some Mickey stuff up here in this color. I like this color because it's like a really faint pink. So I feel like that goes better with this spread. Okay, I'm gonna go with that and I think I'm gonna add in a couple of checklists onto the spread. Sorry, I'm moving everything around. <laughs> These are really pretty. What did I do this color? I don't know what planner this is for, those checklists. Maybe I should do this color. Okay. I always feel bad when I move things around a lot, but because I don't know, some people get annoyed by it. I don't know why, but they do. And some people like seeing it, so I don't know. Hopefully you're in the, I like it to see that. So yeah, <laughs> I move stickers around a lot, sorry. Yeah, I don't know why they're cut like that why they don't fit, but they don't for a reason. And I can't find my X-Acto knife because I remember I took a picture of it for a thumbnail and now I have no idea where I put it. So I'm gonna try to cut this somewhat straight-ish. Okay, that kind of worked. So hopefully I can do that again over here. On this side. Here. Um, I was too, I was way too low. I'm gonna try. Okay, perfect. Alright, yeah, I need to find my exacto knife because I don't like cutting things like that. Okay. You know what? I think the last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fix this Mickey because it's it's not cool. I don't like how it looks. And then I think I will be done. Okay, so I ended up just going with a paper sticker because I was trying to do use whiteout and it was becoming a mess, like literally a mess. My fingers have whiteout all over them. So I scratched it and I just put a Mickey that's paper. It's not perfect. But I think it, it looks better than the other Mickey that was kind of blending into the background, in my opinion. So now I'm happy with it. But yeah, that's going to be my spread. I think it turned out really, really cute. I really love how simple it is on the top. And then I just have like that very decorated section on the bottom. I think, okay, I, I know I said that this is the last thing I was going to do. But, um, or that I was done. But I just thought of something else that I might do and I don't know I don't know if this is gonna be a good idea we'll see though let me see if I can find some actually I don't think okay I kind of want to take this cloud do I have another cloud Okay, this is gonna be my last finishing touch to this spread. I just feel like I need a cloud on this side since I have a cloud on the other side. I'm just gonna cut this out. And then I will be done. Done, done, done. I'm just gonna stick this here. Okay, I feel like that's better. Okay, with that I'm done. I love how this turned out, it's super cute. But yeah, that is my last spread for my 2020 one planner. I love how this turned out. Very excited about this week. So I hope you guys all enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more of my videos, please hit that subscribe button. And I hope to see you guys all in the next one.